Hi, welcome back to the Video Explorer channel. I am Will, and today I'm going to be making a little tiny bushcraft axe, which is the second part of the build to go with the little hunting knife I made last for my brother's birthday. So that's what we're going to be making today with a bit of walnut and a bit of ash for the accents on that as well. So that's today's job. Right, okay, so in this episode, we're gonna be making a little bushcraft ax, hopefully, out of this one that I bought in a load of, I think I've got about four ax heads, and this is just another one out of the, the little stash that I got there. I think I've got another one left after this, but uh, anyway, by the by, this is the one I'm working with today. It's just a little one and a quarter pound ax head. Not a very big one, but uh, I'm gonna try and make that into a little bushcraft style ax. And I'm gonna use this bit of walnut, so it matches with the handle I made for the hunting knife that's going with this as a pair. And I'm gonna use what's left of my little block of ash. I'm gonna make some little accents, hopefully on the bottom of the handle, so where it flares out for the bottom of the handle, that's, that's where the ash is gonna go. I'm not sure whether to like groove it in and have it stuck on so it's a little bit more featureful or not yet. I'm gonna work that out as I go, but this is quite chunky, so I need to strip this down as well. And I'm gonna reshape this little head as well. I'm gonna put a little, Possibly a little curve in the bottom here, and then like a little, just like almost tiny bearded axe, if you will. And that's that's what I have in the intentions of doing with this axe. So uh, let's get it marked out. Let's have a have a go and uh, see where we go.
just coming along really well now. I've got it all sort of shaped up at the minute for the head. So I've done all that grinding work and that's looking rather snazzy now. Quite like the shape of that one. That's, that's come out pretty well that. But down here in the background you can see I've got the handle cut out from the walnut and I've just glued two bits of ash at a bit of an angle. So I want to grind and cut out the bottom of the actual handle it's going to have nice two little accents of ash hopefully which will correspond and match with the knife that's that's the plan anyway so uh, yeah just letting that go off now the old art and uh, then we'll try and start shaping it up so that's where we're at That's fully completed the axe now with the ash accents on the bottom of the handle. I think they've come out rather well. I'm really actually very impressed with how cool they actually look. It's got a nice nice look to that, that has, and obviously with it matching with the knife that I've made. So you've got the, uh, the pair there, so they've both got both ash accents on them. So you've got your hunting knife and your, your little bush crafting style hatchet. It's nicely balanced and it's got a really nice sort of feel to the handle. I'm pretty proud of how well that's actually come out. It's, uh, yeah, it's pretty impressive. I'm hoping my brother's going to be equally as happy with it. And uh, I should get these packaged up and sent off to him. And uh, yeah, and that's that rounded up. So uh, if you've enjoyed this content and you've liked this video, please drop us a like. Hit the subscribe button and whack the old bell button. That would be super cool if you could do that for me and uh, i'll catch you on the uh, on the next time so uh, take care of yourselves and i'll see you again very soon bye bye <laughs>